Hey traders, Raggy here and in this recap video we're going to cover a few of the markets that I've got my eye on going into tomorrow as well as some very exciting announcements coming up on the schedule not only for speaking but some indicator updates. So a lot of you may have already checked out my TOPS video playback that was the webinar that we did last Thursday and that was a blast. I showed you some of my newest indicators as well as some tried and true like my wave and my grab candle. So a lot of people call it the Roggy wave. Cool. I don't mind. Uh, and also my green, red and blue candles. I also have updated the Darvis 2.0. So if you're interested in using Darvis on Thinkorswim, on TradeStation or on TradingView, these are free. These are free, period. OK, the the thinkorswim, you'll have to actually get the shared chart and I'll share that in an upcoming recap video. I'll give you the link. You got to know how to open up the shared chart, but I'll give that to you probably in tomorrow's recap video. TradeStation, go into the trading app store. It is already available in the trading app store. Search under simpler and you'll get the Darvis box, also my propulsion dots, which are amazing, and my grab candles, okay? So when I say free, I mean it, gang, okay? Now, learning how to use these, well, that's part of following our recap videos, following our premium videos, and I'll be doing a class this Saturday. So obviously, I can hand you the keys to the car, or, and you can figure out how to drive around the track on your own, which is totally fine. These are very intuitive, visually clear tools. Or you could, you could drive around the track with me and I'll show you everything that I've learned over the past 30 years on how to use these. So your choice, I think either way, works totally fine. For TradingView, totally excited about this because I'm gonna be talking a lot about how I trade crypto with my tools. One of the main reasons I wanted these tools on TradingView was so I could trade my Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, etc. As well as this is the platform I use through Oanda to trade my Forex. So some of my monster trades like the Euro US, the Aussie US, gosh, one of the unheralded trades is the uh, Dollar Canada. So I hook my account to the, I hook my Oanda account to Trading view and I can trade right through this platform, which is fantastic. These charts are great and they look fantastic on any mobile device. So there's not many mobile device versions of an indicator that work on the on wet on the internet, on your computer online versus on your phone. And, and this works both. So I'm super excited. All right. You can tell I'm kind of stoked about all this. Last thing is I'm going to be in Dallas. We're going to get to our, our, our symbols here in a second. These are all free tools. So gang, I like to let you know when I've got some awesome free things available. I'm going to be in Dallas for the money show. I'll be speaking Friday, October 6th. So if you're at the money show, uh, this is free. I'll be speaking Friday, the 6th. And then on the 7th, courtesy of my good friends at Forest Park FX and Awanda, they're sponsoring a one day Forex trading fast track. If you've wanted to get into Forex currency trading, this is going to be the full day webinar that's going to get you there. I'm going to talk about your plan to build watch lists, trade via the tools that I'm going to give you for free that'll work on TradeStation. They're already working on TradeStation, Thinkorswim, and TradingView. I mean, I'm going to be using TradingView for this presentation because it's fantastic charting, really ideal for Forex traders. So I'll be giving you the tools, a trading plan. I'm going to actually have a manual for you guys, all sorts of great stuff. And my uh, folks that are taking the class this Saturday, my, uh, as we're jokingly calling it, not even jokingly, it is going to be a lot of fun, but the obnoxious profit method, instantly read any chart like a 30 year pro, uh, you guys will get VIP seating right up in front as well as my free intro to Forex class uh, online course before we start this one day fast track. So a lot of great stuff coming. Okay, enough of that. That's what the schedule looks like for me for the next month, which is super exciting. So check out TradingView, search simpler. Check out TradeStation, search simpler. You can download and install those tools right now. Propulsion, 
Darvis, grab and wave. Tomorrow I'll give you guys the toss open, uh, learn how to open a uh, shared chart. So if you're on the think or swim, I'll give you that tomorrow. What have I got on mind? I've on my mind. I've got the the Aussie versus U.S. That's what I've got on my mind right now. Aussie versus U.S. is a pair that's going to be in play because let's take over take you over to the calendar we've got the mon paul meet min uh, the monetary policy meeting minutes coming up 9 30 tonight which means that if you're interested in trading the australian dollar not just versus the u.s dollar which has been a very nice long position we've had but also australian dollar versus new zealand dollar these are the two pairs that have been mostly on my radar because they're both correcting into uptrending overall trends. Um, Aussie Kiwi is probably a little bit better than Aussie US, but most of them are trading with predominantly green grab candles. We've also already entered Aussie US once. We might be interested in doing it again from a much more conservative level. I'll talk about those levels in the premium video and whether or not you want to put on a conservative swing buy or perhaps even a fade. We'll talk about both those alternatives. Aussie New Zealand has sunk into our corrective level. And you'll notice while we don't have any propulsion dots helping out, we do have the majority of green grab candles telling me that this is the time to look for swing buys in this zone, okay? And then a lot of you asked me about Aussie Yen. Am I interested in Aussie Yen? The clarity just isn't there. There are some fresh uptrends, but the yen's been kind of strong because the equities markets have been choppy. I would say leave this one alone for now. In fact, what I'm looking for to look to really get some clarity, what I'm really looking for, and, and that's what all of my tools do. I'm looking for clarity, organization of sentiment, momentum, and trend. The clarity is going to come, I believe in this case, with a new 52-week high. That's what I think is really going to click this off. So when we get a, a brand new cyan dot like we do back here, we get one of these plotting that tells me that that's where the market will be paying attention again in a very bullish way on Aussie yen. I knew I threw it a lot at you here as far as my schedule goes. Everything that I just talked to you guys about from Dallas to the indicators available for free. If you want to join me for the class this Saturday, learn how to use my tools, kind of shortcut you know, the, the, the learning curve, that's what this is all about. So if you want to join me on Saturday, head on over to simplertrading.com forward slash profits, simplertrading.com forward slash profits. And you can join me this Saturday for a five hour. So it's going to be, I give you, give you the long, wrong link. No, I think that's what it is, but you can join me for a five hour presentation that we have coming up this Saturday. And if you want to join me for live trading, I mean, all the all the options are here. And what I would highly recommend, though, download the indicators today, put them on your platform, start playing around with them, get comfortable with them. And then we'll be I'll be teaching you all my indicator matrix, it's basically the formulas for what to do when candles turn blue or green or red, what to ha what to do when the indicator um, go shifts colors, shifts directions, what to do with the propulsion dots, what to do with the support and resistance that's automated with the Darvis. And we'll be doing this not only in the Forex markets, but I'll be walking you guys through this for the NASDAQ, for the S&P, for crude oil, for the futures, for even some stocks. A um, couple of cool examples that I didn't talk about in the uh, presentation last Thursday, one was Costco. This was a very quiet little play that's up 12 points for us. And this was pure Darvis, pure uh, sideways market overbought, oversold kind of stuff. I mean, really good setup, clean setup off the 150 level. So really looking forward to that. Okay, I'll tell you more about it throughout the week. Tonight, however, heads up, Aussie is in play. My mind is on the Forex. Our Forex watch list and book has been really busy. We're going to talk about FOMC tomorrow. So you'll definitely want to tune in for that. See you in the next update.